Aloy, you're here. Did you meet with the Quen already? Not yet. After all the trouble you went through getting those subfunctions, seems unfair you have to deal with these Quen on your own, too. It's safer this way. They think I'm Sobek or something like that. They won't hurt me, but I doubt they'll be so kind to anyone else. Yeah. If you say so. Let me know if you need anything before you go. You better not be slacking off on your studies while I'm gone. And risk Zoe coming after me? I value my life. In fact, I've been reading about Ted Farrow, how he destroyed the world and crawled into a hole after killing those who saved it. He definitely was a piece of work. I hope Zoe's not upset I'm distracting you from your training. Yeah, I don't think you have to worry about that. What do you mean? What happened? Well, before Zoe found a way to fix the land gods, I suggested that when Gaia was fully restored, she could just make new ones. Well, once we get Hephaestus, that's definitely a possibility. That's what I said. But I guess there was something about my tone she didn't like. She got pretty raw. Said I didn't understand the way her tribe feels about those machines. Which is true, of course. And the last thing I'd ever want to do is dismiss their traditions. But I was trying to look at things differently. More like you, you know? To see a machine as just a machine. Yeah, I guess I led you into trouble there, didn't I? <laughs> Not your fault. Don't worry. Did you talk to Zoe after your fight? I suffered through a few hours of glaring silence. Then she seemed to move on. Sort of. How do people do this? How do I know if the next thing I say won't blow up in my face? What if an apology is not enough next time? You give her a stuffed what? animal? You're the worst. You know that? <laughs> what makes you think I know anything about any of this? You're on your own. Abandoning me again, huh? Well, if she kills me next time, it's on you. Well, Beta and Gaia built the rig, can you get everyone ready for the mission ahead? Of course. What is it? Nothing. It's just that everything's about to change. We'll get Gaia, and she'll help us set things right. No more zeniths, no more derangement. It'll be a different world. I welcome it, but I wonder how the Nora will react. And the Karja, and well, everyone. Let's just focus on fixing Gaia for now. I mean, I'm pretty right. sure not everyone is going to be happy We've about it. We've got an angry AI to take down. Anything new with you? Aaron tried to convince me to help him build a... What did he call it? Oh, yeah, a yeah, drum yeah. set? But Release I'm pretty sure Zoe would kill him if it got any noisier around here. Those two are having a hard time getting along, huh? Yeah, they're both stubborn, but they mean well. I'm sure they'll warm up to each other eventually. Is there anything you need from me before I go? Not unless you can somehow make me or Aaron better at that Tanakh board game, Strike. Now that Catalo started playing, I don't like our odds. I'm surprised he agreed to play. Someone might have told him Aaron helped defeat the Mad Sun King. He got friendlier mm. after that. Still doesn't talk much, but he'll sit down for a game whenever he can. If I get Omega Clearance and then we grab Hephaestus, we might finally have the advantage over the Zeniths. Can't wait to see their faces as they stare down a bunch of charging thunder jaws. Better them than us, for once. I'll be in touch if I need anything. We'll be ready. Everyone's been briefed on the pulse generators as well. Good. Yeah, let's stop with so. Aloy, I hear you're going further west, past the Tanakh clan lands. Do you know anything about the area? Only hearsay. The Utaru tell stories of an island that lies beyond the western coast. They call it the Isle of Spires. It is said the Old Ones built towers there that touched the sky, so they could live far away from the earth that bore them. As if they didn't want to be reminded that they'd one day return to it. Sounds like something Ted Farrow would do. Oh, before I forget, I'd like to discuss the land gods again, if you have time. Sure. Any progress with your plan for the land gods? Is the reboot code ready? 
It is. But there is difficult work ahead. Gaia warned me that because the land gods are linked together in a network, the code must be delivered to all of them. Most are in plain song, but in recent years, three of them wandered off. So, T, and Do. We have to find them? No, we know where they are, but they're hard to reach. So, wandered into a lake and sank. Do ventured into a dangerous canyon, and T broke down amidst a herd of machines. Okay, tell you what. You go to Plainsong, handle all the land gods there. I'll take care of So, T, and Do. I'll need their locations, plus the reboot code. I'm sending the data to you now. My people made shrines near where each land god faltered. When you see them, you'll know you're close. And once again, thanks for your help. We're not gonna let your people starve, so I promise. Nice. You ever play that board game Aaron set up? <clears throat> Strike? I'm the one who gave it to him. I was hoping it'd distract him enough to spare us that ruckus he calls death metal. <laughs> no <laughs> such luck. <laughs> oh, you and Ball doing okay? Uh, uh, training, I mean. We're doing fine. Although I admit it'd be nice to take a small break from studying, just the two of us. But then who'd look after Erend? Well, there's always Gatalo. Leave a loud Osaram with a brooding Tanakh. What could go wrong? Right. What's everyone been up to? I've been trying to share some of my meals with Beta. Thought it might help her feel more at home. Maybe even get her to sleep up here instead of in that dark basement. She would not be moved. I appreciate you trying. Patience reaps the best harvest. I'm not giving up hope yet. How much have you read on Ted Farrow? Enough to wonder how a man who worked so hard to heal the world once could let greed and pride condemn it so easily. For one spirit to diminish in such a way, I, I'm not sure if I should hate him or pity him. It looked like you were working on something. Well, I will vote for hating With Gaia on him. now growing in strength, I've been trying to find a way to heal the land gods, even if some people think I should give up on them. Already said I was sorry. Your friend thought it would be a good idea to replace the land gods with new machines when Gaia recovers. It wasn't. The land gods have taken care of our people for generations. They are not some broken toy to be thrown away. Even if they are just machines doing their job, to abandon them in their time of suffering seems cruel. I'm sure Varl understands that too. He does now. I had to get pretty mad at him at first though. You know I can hear you guys, right? <laughs> I mean, he's right Carl next to us, so yeah. He's been obsessing over the data revealed to us by Poseidon. Just the other day, we read about mountains hiding deep underwater that spew fire. If I understand correctly, Gaia said the flames they release come from the very center of the Earth. Like a heart beating with the life of the world. As always, the cycle can be found in even the most unlikely of places. Of course... Varl's mostly interested in watching explosions happen underwater. I assume you've been looking into Demeter now that Gaia's merged with it? Yes. It's been humbling to know that the seeds I carry in this pouch came in turn from the seeds saved for Demeter in the Old World. It gives me hope that the cycle of life will prevail now just as it did before. Oh, how should she get going? That was all. Hopefully I can bring back what we need to capture Hephaestus. Mm -hmm. After that, I'm gonna need everyone's help. We'll be ready. Now, I do want to talk with Beta. Um... Yes. Did you? Uh, hi. I'm back. What do you want to know? So, do you have everything you need to build the rig and pulse generators? 
Gaia sent me the schematics. The designs are modest, without the capabilities of Hephaestus, but they should work. Not that it matters without a mega clearance. I'll find it. Just try to have the transport ready by the time I get back. So, aside from Varl and Gaia, who else have you been talking to? Zoe told me how you met after your escape from the Hades Proving Lab. I had no idea you were severely injured. If the Zenith had killed you, life on Earth would be doomed. My escape would have been for nothing. But they didn't kill me. And thanks to Varl and Zoe, I was able to recover. You said you and Varl talk sometimes. What about? He told me about your tribe, the Nora, and the proving ritual you did. I told him if I was born into the tribe, I'd never be able to do the proving. It does require a lot of physical training, but there are plenty of other roles besides being a hunter. I don't think I'd be suited for any of them. Well, I guess it's a good thing you're not a Nora then. That was awkward. <laughs> it's well, time for me to go. It was a better conversation than last yeah, time, but sure. still pretty awkward. Hmm. Well, well, well. This must be the village Zoko was talking about. I should see if they're okay. Is he all right? Uh, he will be. Uh, there. But what about the others? Let me worry about that. Rest now. I'm Natika. You're a long way from the east, Outlander. You're Natika. So this must be Bleeding Mark. What's left of it? How do you know this place? The Inker's apprentice and Scalding Spear told me to find you. He was worried something happened to your supply caravan. Well, as you can see, we have more important problems than delivering ash blood. What happened here? The last storm caused a deluge that brought down half of the mountain. Oof. The mudslide barreled right through the village. As you heard, we have many missing, but I need to keep watch on these two. I can take a look around. If I find anyone, I'll send them your way. Much appreciated. And if you see an older soldier, grim-faced, goes by Kentok, uh, tell him... Tell him I'm here. Oh. Might be able to use my focus to find any survivors. Yeah, it looks great. Yeah, it is you. some stuff Oh burger Hey you Outlander Huh Here. We've got wounded up here Need an easy way down 
Uh, hold on. I'll figure something out. I need to find a way for the Tanox to get down from the cliff. That big crane could help. If I can get it into the right position, I could make a bridge for them. Oh, I was like, what? Where are they? I don't see anyone. Oh, that's a snap ma. Great. Off some of the sweat. I must be stuck on something else. My focus can help me search. Hmm. Where is it? Could you did... focus here? Yes, that's what I need. Mm. I mean, I do see that, but how do I... Is it underwater? What was that? There, more rubble. Oh? I'm letting that fire gleam to clear it. I want to swim away from this. Whoa. Okay, cranes in place. I know, I know. Just I know. To look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. There he is, I see it. I know it. Don't worry about it, I got it. You have that get out of here. I see it. Better try again from a different angle. I don't think I can pull the beam from here. Why not? Oh, okay. Then I don't get it. Easy. Whoop. Oh, damn it. Arm stuck on something. I better climb up and take a look. that if I detach those cables the arms should drop the rest of the way this thing's about to drop watch out we're clear whoa I don't know if I would count that safe but it was the tin how'd you manage to do that pretty good no are you kidding me Oh. 
before you go. I don't know how you did it, but thanks for the rescue. Has everyone No okay? worries. His legs snapped against some debris as we were making a run for it, but he'll live. How'd you get stuck up here? A mudslide tore through the village in the last storm. This ledge was just above the flood when we got to it. But by the time everything calmed down, the water had receded, leaving us stranded. And we couldn't leave a fellow soldier behind. Can you make it to the shore from here? Natika's there, tending to the wounded. Natika. Thank the ten. We'll head for her location. She'll know what we should do next. When the mudslide hit, I saw some of the others running towards the metal towers. You might want to check there. Thanks. I'll look into it. Aloy. Why? <laughs> after the flood. I didn't see anyone who looked like him. I knew he's with the other survivors. Hmm. Machines oh. got us trapped up here. We lost our weapons in the mud. Survivors on that broken watchtower. Okay. Let me make it till here. Oh my god, why are you following me? Oh god dang it No, don't swim I hate it here. The music is so good, damn. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Take it.
We're coming down. I don't like snuff moths. They can go really crazy. I could use their parts though, that's for sure. Soon enough. Is everyone okay? Better now, without snap moths prowling around. You sure know how to fight. During the storm, I think I saw some of our comrades running toward the metal towers on the west end. They might need a hand too, if you're willing. Okay, I'll check it out. Have you seen Kentok? Natika asked me to keep an eye out for him. Last I saw him was before the mudslide hit. Okay. Head for the shore, on the other side of the village. Natik is there with the other survivors. Will do. Thanks again. Are those the metal towers? Probably. We're trapped in the tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay, I'll find a way to get to you. I need to get to the ladder at the top of the building. Maybe there's a way to cross over from the broken one next to it. I should try oh, too far person. away. Not too far away. Um, let's see. Hi, hey, Yelena. I cannot climb up, that's for sure. Let's see if we can enter from the water. Does it really look like it? Started so nothing really. I, like no. the I need something to get me over the metal wall and inside. Tree, maybe? See, so, yeah, I just pretty much started. So, there's nothing really. Okay, that works. That works. Now I just need to climb inside to get to the top. Do you want to get this one before it comes out? Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's oh no. 
My dog is going crazy with her ear. Yeah. This is a great place. Give me a sec. I want to check my dog ear. Where's my phone? Thank you. I think we're gonna have a trip to the wet. Tomorrow or on Friday. No. Oh, I see it now. Oh, this way. There's the ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. Yes, you can. Give me a sec. <laughs> what do I do with this letter? Climb around, chill out. Everyone okay? You're not one of us. Sorry. Yes. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village, but debris blocked the passage we came in through. That ladder was our only way out, but we couldn't reach it from here. Don't worry. I'll find us another way out of here. Do you know what happened? to the others there are more who made it they're safe now thank the ten as soon as you're out head for the shore Natika's waiting on an overlook there so she survived yeah good we'll join her as soon as we have a way out okay sit tight for now <laughs> I 
No. Okay, anything else that I need to do? In a way, please. What is going on? Why is this so glitchy? in a moment okay I think that's it for survivors Maybe it's a Ken talk among I should head back to Natika yeah honestly it's pretty hard to survive something like this For the follow, Harry Bounty. <laughs> Did you hear about the police station that had its toilet stolen? The cops had not been gone. Oh well, no. <laughs> Rest now. Aloy, thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Ken Talk? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Yeah, me neither. Where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the chief's guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakh are stubborn fighters, but Kentok so is queue. more so than most. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. Hey, I'm here. I just gave my dog her ball, so maybe she will be a bit chill, but I think we're gonna have to go to the vet. Coffee. I can take another look. I drop big thanks for the crab rave and the coffee. Natika. I'm here. Where's Ken Talk? Did he make it? We're going to find him. He so what are you me. doing? Pushed me out of the way as everything collapsed. But then the flood took him. Towards the gouge. The gouge? It's an ancient passage that leads deep underground. Come. I'll show you. Natika. We need orders. We're exposed out here. Only half of us can hold a blade if machines come. What do you want us to do? Go. The gouge is in the hillside, northwest of here. I'll catch up when I can. What are we going to do now? Let's get a couple soldiers close to this lookout to start. Well, I'm okay, but Lily is kind of going crazy with her ear. So she's very uncomfortable doing a little bit of annoying things.
So around five, I'm just gonna take a break. Looks like an old mine. And I'm gonna use a little eardrop in her ear and clean it. And then make a coffee. And maybe she will relax a little bit. Okay, let's see where this leads. I just saw that nothing went inside her ear, but she's like being all over the place. Oh, take it easy. You must be Ken Talk. Oh, I was an Outlander. Know my name. Natika sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. I'm so... he made it. Good. And... Natika... she came back? Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. It was... my mistake to... deny her discharge. A soldier... is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now, she was right. I didn't want to let her go. The chief's guard will gain an invaluable soldier. At least after all this, I won't be in the way anymore. I can tell you know a fatal wound when you see one. My service to my clan is done. So, leave me. No, you're not going to die down here. There has to be a way to get you out. There isn't. I tried to climb out, but it's no use. The walls are too slick. Water's coming in. From the surface? But not from where I came in. There must be another source. And if I find it, and open it up... You might not be able to move, Kentok, but I think there might be a way to move you. Hey. Hey. I need you to stay awake. I'm gonna take a look around. Um, I'm not sure if we can save him, though. You're just like Natika. Relentless as a fire claw. And you should be used to it. Just sit tight. I'm going to get you out of here. That waterfall must be coming from somewhere. I need to get higher up to where it's coming from. Hmm? There's nothing this way. Oh. But yeah, other than not being worried, all is good. <laughs> I want to go to that box. Oh, wait, do I have to grab it? No. I want that box! Give me that stupid box! For my pole caster to latch on to. Oh my god, why are you doing this to me? Hey. Oh. This looks like. <clears throat> A safe thing.
How? Ah, uh, I see. saw down below should be coming in from somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. Hmm. Is there anything down there? No. Wanna go down? Sometimes it's hard to be Eloy. Let's go, lay. coming in from there. I can use the fire gleam to break open that wall. And this, this should fall. Sure, this is explosion. a good idea. You're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. Yeah, I don't know if he's gonna make it. He doesn't look good. that every time we sparred sometimes as an insult <laughs> other times as a compliment but i guess he was right it was always my choice to stay or go i'm sorry you didn't get to make amends so am i what will you do now i'm not sure lady mark has a chance to recover and once that's done i could join the chief's guard but I have to lay him to rest first. With full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades, somehow drained the entire village. I want you to have this. Thanks. And good luck. Whatever you decide. Everything okay? What are you doing out here? Ask my grandmother. I risked leaving guard duty to look for her. She stopped to see the bloom, and now she won't leave. Since when does she care about flowers? They're not just flowers, child. They're scarlet stems with the scent that soothes the nerves. Or so I was told many years ago by an Utaru seed tracker. An Utaru? Now you're telling stories. If one trespassed here back then, you'd have killed him on sight. I couldn't. Found him picking flowers, right near here, in Tanakh territory. I was all set to strike him down, but he was singing. 
singing? Can't remember the tune now. Just the lilt of his voice. And his name, Nilo. He decided to stay for a day or two. I took guard duty here so I could keep coming back to him. And he kept delaying his return to plain song. For the flowers, he said. Mm -hmm. Please don't tell me I'm descended from a Nutaro gardener. Almost. Almost. But the thrill of battle called to me, and he had to return to his people. I've always wondered about the life I missed with him, whether he misses it too. Would he welcome me in plain song, or at least accept a scarlet stem? It's a long way to plain song, but I get back there now and then. I could pick some scarlet stems and bring them to Nilo, if I can find him. Please. He was an herbalist there. I know the time has long since passed, but I'd like to know. Well, I'd like him to know. Ugh, you know what I mean. Oh, I think I do. <laughs> Encouraging an old woman? Why would you do that? Why would Everyone you? deserves love. And compassion and caring. Let's gather the scarlet stems. I mean, they weren't really enemies. I'll handle this. Uh, no, I don't want to fight. Oh. Looks like the outlander has it under control. Could I do with acid? No ammo. Oh, and here comes their friends. Oh, shut up. Now, can I pick up the flowers? I only came here to pick up flowers. These are beautiful flowers, not gonna lie. Especially that they are purple. Oh no, I don't need this. Oh, there's a sh gleam shine thingy there. I'm not mistaken. Oh, I was imagining things then. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, I wasn't. It's here. Soldiers have gotten themselves in trouble again. You big T Rex, I don't want to fight now with you. Oh, here. That fire gleam. Is 
secret tunnel. Tunnel, tunnel. Still alive in here. Hey. Huh? Oh, you. So you're real. Thought I was dreaming. What happened to you? A terror in the dark. The world shuddered. A machine? Never got a look. The caravan. <sighs> we all ran. Everything collapsed. Crawled here. Couldn't escape. Did anyone make it out? And find the first caravan? Yes. Someone did. Good. At least... I'm not alone. Oh. Easy now. Sounds like something big attacked the missing expedition. I better press on. Yeah, me neither. Because it means that some big guys are around. The others didn't notice. Let's go down. Damn. She's calling back up. Does it mean he's angry or is he dying? Hey, I think I got all of them. She said they were attacked by some kind of terror. I didn't think it was these burrowers. No, they seem pretty regular. I 
I have a feeling that it's gonna be those giant moles or whatever they call which go underground which I had pretty hard time fighting in the previous game I have a feeling it's gonna be them I don't like those guys Yes, I'm just looting. Hello. I got something's attention. Sounds like it's coming from further in. Are you? What are you? Are you a snake? Really? I wanna loot first, though. What the? I don't like the sound of them. Why? I knew it. I told you. I told you. I literally told you. What is he shooting at? <laughs> I hate these guys. Where is he? this Ow. can you stop bro Die. Well, that's one rock breaker that won't be troubling anyone anymore. The officer must have entered the canyon from the eastern side of Orgriff's lockbox. I should take it back to him. This guy was stuff. But it was definitely easier with the weapon that I have. What is this?
I was gonna read this right. Something blue here. Alrighty. I think we can go. That wall looks like it came down when the rock breaker attacked. Must have trapped the Ozer in the canyon. The rest must have run into the western tunnel. Trying to get to the other side. I should be able to blow this up to clear the debris. Yeah. The way out. The tunnel should be clear now. I better let Porgif know. Does not look that safe though, I'm sure. Mom, you were right. I couldn't even reach the safe. It was total mayhem in the tunnel. Explosions and everything, so all that stuff isn't going to do me any good. If anybody finds this, take it all. The door code is 20... 2054. Instead, I'm stuck here with two families. I took them into the maintenance room for shelter. A six-year-old just spilled our water by accident. I'm almost out of battery. No reception. I don't think anyone's coming for us. I hope you're better off than me. I data corrupted. Oh no. Twenty fifty four. It's kind of tragic. I think it was when the swarm were attacking them. Climb up that cliff. That'd be a shortcut over the mountain. Let's go. One of the things that I like about this game is the exploration part. 
You can explore a lot of things around here. Is he gonna come here? These random squishy sounds are great. So, if we add all the days lost to being stuck in camp, no, you're back. How's that tunnel looking? I found the rest of your crew. One of them was still alive for a while, anyway. Turns out a rock breaker attacked them as they were making their way through. Poor Saz. Many roads lead to Adelva's end, but. That's got to be one of the worst. Well, I took care of the rock breaker. The way's clear now. Ha <laughs> ha! I knew you could do it. And, uh, you didn't happen to find my lockbox now, did you? Here you go. Spark in the dark. Is there nothing you can't do? Fee as promised. Now that the threat's gone, I'll have the tunnel shored up and cleared out. Then I can send for another crew, get this expedition going proper like. Ha! Onwards to the delve! I'm sure there's a rebel outpost here, I feel Red. Mm. Got something you'll want to hear, Red. Okay. Harris. You might want to avoid going too deep into the desert, especially the southwest. One of our scouts ran into some nasty Tanakh down there, the kind that contain machines. He barely made it back alive. Thanks for letting me know. The rebels are as friendly as ever. Yeah, we were here before, remember? This is where I spent an eternity figuring the puzzles out. I remember. <laughs> No, why is her land called? This must be the shrine of the land god. Must be past those lines. Line cutter's working. Let's take a look. There, up on that ledge. I'm up to that land, God. It looks like this one's been here for a while. I won't be able to install the reboot code with these vines in the way. But where there's vines, there's a metal flower. There's More flight. metal flower? There, sure. the flower. If I can deactivate it, the land God will be free from the vines. And I'll have to find a way up there. Climb up here. Oh, 
or not? Hello? Should be able to access that cave now. S that treadwing carcass. It must have dropped the flowers and then crashed. Whoa. Oh, there's another flower there. Looks like I can climb up the side of the cliff. Might help me get to that metal flower. There's another one. No. Whee! Now I just need to get rid of these vines. installed. Just planted the reboot code on Doe. He's a bit tangled up, but he's better now. Good to hear. Doe always returned to the sacred cave at the end of winter, so his festival foretold the coming of spring. During those times, I remember clinging to my mother by the hearth, snuggling for warmth, and listening to her sing of new beginnings. Which is exactly what you're going to give to your people. I hope so. All right, then. I'll head to Plain Song and deliver the code to the land once there. Okay, I wonder what I'm gonna unlock with this one. Going very far away back. Hmm. Let's go to this. Actually, then I don't want to waste. It's not that far away. I wanna go to the side where we don't, we didn't really, um, like this way, where we didn't really discover much yet. I'm 
which is this way, I think. Green shine here. What's here? Oh, a vista point. Oh, come back. Where are you going? Hello. mountains Question mark here, though. Is it a bunker? What is it? Is it far away? Oh yeah. Oh shit. Okay. Come, boy. Oh, that's some way to come down. means to the Otaru. So we are going for a sleep. The land god is underneath that level. Yes. We better stay away from that. Oh fuck. I was not expecting having a company down here, but um, this should help you get back on track. That should do nice. It. Easy money. And we have one more to go. Do we have anything else down here? swim a bit, but I gave the reboot code to So. Ah, good. We used to celebrate So in the fall, at the beginning of the harvest, with wine made from elderflowers. 
When I was 12, I got tipsy on it and kissed a boy in the sage garden. How'd that go? He was so surprised he nearly fell into the mulch. It would be good to see so again. Plowing the fields in the afternoon sun. How are things on your end? Getting there. A few land gods to visit still. Okay. I'll call you when I'm done with the last part. Thank you, Aloy. Mm, there's a black box somewhere in here. Not sure if I'm even going to the right direction now. I feel like I kind of lost it. Oh! A rush of air! I don't think I've been here before. Okay, this this is this calls for a picture. This is absolutely beautiful. Okay, so where is that thing that I'm looking for? It's really not necessary for me to look. But I just want to. Don't see me. I'm not here. I want to get that green shine. Cannoli, macaroni. Too close. Not too bad. This place looks really scary though. These were all the fire robots. 
an attack originally. And that thing, the giant robot is absolutely unbelievably scary. It's like, how do you even fight against that thing? Even these are gigantic, but like, how do you even fight against that? This black box. I feel like I'm getting farther and farther from that thing. But I assume it's underwater very much. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's there. Why am I doing this? I don't know. The look here shows there's another recording in there. Like, I can't really fight underwater. But I'm way too curious. I wanna know what's in here. Plane. I can't raise the airfield. Must have been destroyed. Well, we're out of time and out of fuel. I have to put us down on that lake. Let's give these soldiers a chance to die fighting. This is the flight deck. We're going for a water landing. Leave everything behind except what you need for the fight. Now's your time to go out in a blaze of glory. Race! Race! I wonder if any of those soldiers survived long enough to fight the machines. Trying to survive. This pharaoh's machine has swept the planet of life. Lost to one man's ego. Yep. There's another locator beacon in this one. Is it here? I don't think so. Don't see it anywhere. Well, let's get out of here. No, I'm not here. Go away. I'm finished. So I don't want to fight. I just came for a swim. You can go away. You can go in our separate ways. Let me actually save. Oh, hello. Steal to my soul, my wares are the finest. What is this? Oh, I the slicer. I don't really need it. Good buddy, but thanks. Now let's get back on track. Oh, a metal flower, hold on.
Can we not fight, please? Like, I don't want to. We're just here. What are you doing? Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh my god. They were like, no. You can't leave. Holy shit. Look at this monstrosity. What the fuck? Oh, we were here before. This is where silence led us. Um, okay, well, I guess I'm swimming through. See you on the other side. I'll shake it out as I go. Oh, green shine. I saw green shine. the truck that too what the heck okay. uh, I'm usually better with fishes but bro that fish doesn't want to die I will give her that Can I not kill you? No? Just with arrows? Alright. I feel that... That's her lip. something the other way why can't I attack you cheating it's called cheating supply box oh there you are I was like where is it but well, let's check it out then I guess I'm getting sidetracked here. <laughs> oh 
ou não. Aqui. Aqui. So said this one broke down amidst a herd of machines. I better be careful. Oh, great. I'm going back there. Oh, let's examine the corpses, yes. I guess they were leaving offerings to the land god. Mm. That looks like something... Fried them. Whatever right. to be around. Oh, boy. Where's the land god? But I'll have to deal with those machines before I install the reboot code. Should be able to override scroungers now. What about the scrapper or the revenger? The revenger? The revenger? The revenger? The revenger? Uh, nope. Still not his face, please. It's going great. I'm getting sidetracked a lot, but that's just me. <laughs> but we are getting there. Please fight with each other. I'm just a really enough to have a very well played of course. Yes. Nice. Well, he's not gonna stay over ridden for very long I can grab this from my stash later oh hello what are you doing Stuck under you. No ammo, that's the best that you can hear. Green. I'm 
Nice. Um, what the? I thought you're dead. That's all the machines. Time to install this code on that land god. Nice floating flower. Flipping now. Ouch. Um. Oh my god, I'm stuck in a tree. Why are you here? when I use my search again for whatever this is better almost dead are you dead now? No. Oh, please. Okay. Let's get this code installed on that land god. Now that was unexpected. Let's try this again. Nice and easy. That's the last land god. Zo, can you hear me? I can hear you, Aloy. I found T and installed the reboot code. Fitting then that I feel thankful. T's festival came in winter, when all the grain from the harvest was stored away. It was a season of gratitude, and all the children would receive gifts. was my first bow made of you strung by my father well he definitely taught you how to shoot well that he did there's mm. one more thing i found two of your people but i took it down oh i'll make sure someone retrieves their seat pouches so they may return to the land when you can meet me at plain song and i'll send out the reboot signal I've delivered the code to all the land gods, save one. Only La is left. I'm here with her, just east of the main village. Oh, okay. look at them! Yeah. 
are walking around here. What is she doing with Mark? Taylor, you made it. Souls back. All of the land gods have been updated. Now to send out the reboot signal. Bit lucky, but <laughs> oh, see, what does this mean? A new beginning. Gaia told me this would happen to all of them Do, T, So, and the rest. She called it. A reboot sequence. But I didn't think it would be so beautiful. Soon the land gods will return to tilling the soil as they once did. Zo, the chorus wants a word. Of course they do. Do you want me to come? No need. I'll just tell them that our lands will soon bloom again. Who are they to argue? Find me later, and I'll tell you how it went. Good luck. This is pretty nice. Hello, Thornmarsh. Quite a sight, isn't it? Never thought I'd find myself this deep in Tanakh territory. Have you run into any trouble? I've been keeping my head down. Had to duck into the swamps a couple of times to avoid Tanakh patrols. Well, I'm here now, so spill it. Who is Amatis, really? Like I said before, he helped me put a stop to a hunter-killer machine out in the wilds. At first, he thought I was just another hunter from the lodge who only cared about the biggest machine trophy. And I thought he was just a grouchy hermit living in the woods. But then, he trusted me with the truth. Told me how... The Red Raids took everything from him. Seeing that side of him, I don't know, changed things. You love him, don't you? I think I might, yeah. Oh, I knew it! Part ways. When he told me how he failed to save the woman from his past, I told him how I made peace with my father and brother's deaths. He realized he needed to do the same on his own. Wait. When we searched that Red Raid's battlefield together, you said he'd lost someone close to him there. I thought you meant a fellow soldier. Well, she was. Women aren't allowed to serve in the Karja army, but... Nessa disguised herself so she could. Amadis kept her secret. When he left to come out west, he promised he'd send word that he was all right, but... his letter never came. So you set out to find him. And when we do... I'll have words for him for leading us on this wild goose chase. Well, at least I kind of understand now. Amadis thought Nessa died on the battlefield, but when he learned that the Tanakh took prisoners back west, he kept going. So I guess now we find this prison, the Rot. I did some scouting while I was waiting. I think I might have found the way. Lead on then. Do you think Nessa might still be alive? I doubt it. Any Karja prisoners from the Red Raids would have been killed or returned home by now. Then what's Amadis after? I think he just Revenge. needs to know. Probably. Girl, that's a trap. Don't run into it. Flaming hunk of scrap. That's him. Oh, that fire claws right on his heels. Come on. Oh. We got your back. Not now. <laughs> Come on, Aloy. Give it to him. I was not 
Signing up for this. No ammo. Oh my god, thank you. <gasps> what the fuck? Hold on. What the? Come this way then. To the traps. I don't want death into my face, please. Oh. Thanks on the crazy. Oh, thank it. Big angry bear. Big angry fire bear. Oh, put these in my pack. Yes. How are you doing? Talana, I... You were supposed to let me know you were okay. I was going to send the message right after I crossed into the desert with an Osaram caravan. But when it became clear that the tunnel had collapsed behind us, I figured the only thing I could do was press on. Seeing as you found a way out here, however, clearly I was wrong. I'm sorry. The last thing I wanted was to worry you. So, you must be Amadis. And you must be Aloy. Talan has told me a lot about you. And I guess you must know about me. Uh, a little. We know you're headed for the rot. But what are you hoping to find there? A clue. Or a shred of one. Anything about Ness's fate. Maybe she died on the battlefield. Or maybe she wasted away in that prison. Either way, I have to know. Talana told me about you and Nessa during the Red Raids. I'm doing bad just you kept your um. secret. We were both assigned uh. to the Southern Spear mm. Division. Our orders um. were to push into the Tanak territory me. through the tunnel. Um. She was proud to serve the Sunday at first. Mm, yeah. But as the atrocities mounted, we both saw the raids. That means always good. And the two of you grew close? We did what we could to protect innocent lives. It felt like we were the only ones who objected to the slaughter. And yes, we were close. You please. Until the battle of the burning blooms. The virus of the... That pineapple pizza is spreading, I see. So, you and Talana, um... Sounds like the two of you had an adventure out in the wilds. Claw striders, a hunter killer, mercenaries, a shell snapper. Nothing could get in her way. A scruffy hermit in the woods certainly tried. That was foolish of him, in hindsight.
Well, we're here now, so let's head to the rot. I can't ask you to come with me. I feel bad enough you've come this far. I didn't come all this way just to leave you now. We'll see this through together. I know better than to try to talk you out of it. Come then. The rot's not far. The rot's along the shore, but we'll have to stick to the woods to avoid being seen. Well, pineapple cake find sounds it? actually good. I overheard a Tanakh patrol from the nearby Was it a cheesecake or a normal cake? What were you gonna do if we hadn't found you? Take it on alone? I only need to question one guard. Figured I'd grab someone when they're by themselves. Well, now you have us. We're getting close. Just a little further. There it is. The rot. Those are Regal's rebels. They're waging civil war against the rest of the Tanakh. They must have taken over the prison. Then they would have killed any of the guards. They were my last hope of finding out if Nessa was there. Maybe not. There might still be some clue inside. Even after all this time? Aloy can see much more than you or I. Then let's do it. Any scrap of hope is better than nothing. We'll have to find another way in. The front gate looks impenetrable. I have a feeling that she's and in love no with him, but he's he's walls. in love with the girl we are chasing at the moment. Here. I'll see if I can find but another me. way in and get that gate open. No, just a normal cake with some cream, but it was still really good. I had two slices and it might have been too much, but it was worth it. I can't have too much cake. Don't worry about us. Get that gate open. We'll head in as soon as you get the gate open. Oh. As soon as you open the gate, we'll be right at your side. Ah. Why? Why can I shoot this? Where? All right. Lots of trucks here. Uh, I don't think so, yes. Because my um, focus didn't really pick up anything. I will just check around if I can. And I will see. And yes, it's never too much. It's about the cake. Oh. am I going in? I don't think that I had so much trouble getting inside somewhere than here. Oh, 
true, but I could barely move afterwards. So it was a bit too much. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see anything at all. These are just trucks. They're not... Me! It's me! Come out! Open the flipping door for me, please! We should start over there! Hello! I'm here! Open the door! Thank you! Open it! Open it! Open the door! I'm here! Open the door! I think I'm on the right side. Do you think so? <laughs> Hello! They are dummy dumbs. You see, they don't want to open the door. Like, I don't really know what I'm not seeing, but I'm clearly missing something here. I will swim around. Maybe I will notice something. I don't think that this is gonna be our solution, but. You never know. I've gotta get to the main oh. with Tamana and Amadison. It was actually the solution. What the heck? Oh, not this guy. No, not this guy. No, no, no. Fuck. Um. Get into the water. A lot more guys that way. So either I get killed now or later by my superiors. Great. They'll be back. Steal okay. yourself. Clear. I should like. Oh my god, no. 
Thank you. This was done expertly. It's her. We need everyone on alert. You have thought about getting killed Be before signing up for a rebellion mode, Nothing yes. Here. Is this gonna work? Fuck. It's me, I'm grass. Noticing me, Bruh. okay, that one, well. Oh my god. Thank you for coming right to my space. Now there's this guy that I need to sneak up to. Oh, he's coming to me. Great. Come closer. Maybe stabby stab you. What do you mean? I'm a great looking grass. Any sign? Everyone is dead, bro. It's just you. And you're gone. This is coming with me. Now I can open the bridge for them. I aspire to be one, thank you. <laughs> I'm not always that successful, but I am trying.
Perfect like skills one. there. Well, I'm trying. Only you, but that's kind of sad for you. You make a nice target. Whoa, let's go. Nice. Oh no, it's gonna take. Oh, that device is gonna call a machine. Of course, he pressed it. Of course, he did. Are we going to have a sea monster again? What the? Oh no, not this again. I refuse. Pretty epic. Hey, that's cheating. You can only stay in the water. Ow. Didn't we have like a big weapon here somewhere? Fuck. Oh my god. Let me go from here, please. Gonna grab that weapon, what the fuck? Just grabbing this, don't mind me. Or not grabbing this. I don't know if it was worth the effort, but... Bruh. Ammo? We were just the rain. Maybe I'm not here. Oh, what kind of bird is that? Never seen this before in this. Anycon feather, okay. I did want to loot, but let's let's Here. talk with them. Doors yeah, locked, it was a pelican. Had a key on it. I got press. Freed by Karja. Have we not been humiliated enough? It's not their fault you were locked up in your own prison. I'm looking for information about a Karja soldier. 
She might have been a prisoner here five years back. Her name was Nessa. The Karja Nessa was here. I killed her myself. Nessa? I'll handle this. Go secure the grounds. It's you, isn't it? Nessa, how? It's Why? It's Rataka. Uh, let me get this straight. You were Nessa. You were brought here as a prisoner during the Red Raids and then became Tanakh? The Karja forbid women from military service. I lived my life pretending, ashamed of who I really was. But the Tanakh measure a soldier only by their strength and resolve. So I took my place among them. Ness... Rataka, I've mourned you for five years. Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I had a new life. I wasn't going back. Not even for you, Amadis. The way Amadis talked about your time together, I thought you'd still care about him. It was five years ago. I didn't abandon you. Before the battle, I tried to get Gadiah to call off the attack, but of course, he didn't listen. I ended up killing him. Then he got what he deserved. I ran for the battlefield to find you. But you were already gone by the time I got there. I didn't know. But even if I did, I mourned you, and then I moved on. Wow. If you were brought here as a prisoner, That's a bit harsh. how did you become Tanakh? I knew it was only a matter of time before the Tanakh killed me and the others who were held captive. But one day, one of their soldiers stopped in front of my cell, asked how a woman had ended up fighting for the Mad Sun King. As he spoke, I realized he was once Karja. Fashav. Oh, Fashav! I heard how he fell at the embassy. He deserved a better death than that. The other prisoners he condemned to death, but he convinced the Tanakh to let me fight for my life. I won through blood and blade. I became Rataka and never looked back. You were willing to wear a disguise so that you could serve in the Karja army. Do you miss being Karja at all? No. The Red Raids showed me there was no honor in fighting for the Karja. And when my comrades and I were brought here as prisoners, we knew no one would ever come for us. I would have, had I known. It's better this way. Beneath my Karja armor, I found I had the blood of a Tanakh. So if you became Tanakh, how did you end up as a prisoner here again? My squad was ordered to retake the rot from Regala's rebels. We failed. Considering how much Regala seems to hate the Karja, I'm surprised her rebels let you live. You're right. I'd be dead if they knew. But few Tanakhs remember who I once was. What will you do now? You've taken back the rot. My squad will ensure it stays that way. So this is it? After everything we've been through, this is goodbye? It has to be. My place will always be here, and yours is back east. I'm sorry that you've suffered. You deserve better than how the last five years have treated you. I'll make sure you're granted safe passage out of the lowland. Consider it Nessa's final farewell. At least that now you know the truth. must be tough. Somehow it hurts worse. You must think I'm an idiot. No. I just think you have a lot to figure out. I'll take you back east to the Sendim. After that... I don't know. Talana, I... understand. I'm sorry it came to this. Me too. Give me an Aloy a moment. Are you alright? To be honest... no. What's going to happen between you two? I'm not sure. He clearly has a lot more feelings to sort through. And I won't be anyone's second choice. I want you to have this. For seeing this through with me. 
No hawk can no, ask these for two, no. Not only loves him, but he doesn't friend. love her the same way. So, I guess this is it then. You're heading back east. I think I'll hang around Baron Light for a while before returning to Meridian. If you find yourself back that way, look for me there. I will. Safe travels, Talana. Yeah, I feel sorry for her, but that's just life. Maybe I should check in with her the next time I'm at Baron Light.